The brand new Young Bucks promo will be dropping tomorrow in NBA Live Mobile Season 6. All of these screenshots that we did get for the new promo are from EA's Discord server. The link to that will be in the description down below. But you can see you have got a bunch of new masters, all ranging from 97 to that Grandmaster 104 DeAndre Ayton. He's giving out a team boost and it is a rebounding one, which is looking really nice. And he is 104. But it says it's time to engage with the legends of the present generation who are expert millennials and Gen Z in all aspects of the game play the young buck events on the live today map to earn millennial tokens and 83 to 92 overall players and trade them in for young buck players in the sets visit the store for more supplies and for store exclusive players so it is going to be one of those live today promos focusing around all of these players over here let me know in the comment section down below what generation are you because i'm gen z and it'd be interesting to see i think a lot of you guys probably watching are also gen z we might have a couple of millennials watching as well but taking a quick look at some of their stats if you want to take a more in-depth look you can by all means pause the video at any point but deandre Ayton he's going to be a playstyle select center he's got some good rebounding stats at 99 and 96 he's got 102 strength which is good for a center card 99 agility 101 dunking and 98 layup 100 mid-range shot which is looking really nice an 84 three-point shot you're not really going to be shooting too many threes with him but he's also got a 97 shot off the dribble and a 94 scoring with contact on the defensive end, looking pretty nice over there. Most of those stats in the high 90s, a couple of them in the 99s as well. And then you've got a 98 block and then the playmaking stats are pretty nice with a 97 passing accuracy and a 92 court vision. Alongside all of that, as I mentioned earlier, you are getting that elite rebounding boost to team, which is going to be pretty good over there. Then you've got Shea Gilgis Alexander, SGA. He's a 102 strategic shooting guard. Let's take a look at some of his stats. A fairly low three point shot for a shooting guard i'd expect that to be a lot higher especially considering he is a 102 but it's at 91 he's got a 96 mid-range shot a 100 shot off the dribble 100 on ball defense 101 layup and a 93 dunking as well as well as that 93 speed and 96 agility then on the defensive end you're not really going to look at too much with a shooting guard but he's got some good playmaking stats with 100 court vision but then an 85 passing accuracy which isn't too good so he's kind of like a mismatch with some of these stats i don't think he's amazing just based off of that three point shot which you have got a lot more guys that have got better ones especially in the game at the moment and then you've got yourself this Jaden Springer over here he's a power shooting guard and he's 100 overall that is a much better three-point shot for a shooting guard. It's 100 on this 100 overall master. He's got a 93 mid-range shot, 92 dunking, 93 layup, 93 scoring with contact, and a 99 shooting touch, as well as that 99 shot off the dribble. Then on the defensive end, you're not really going to look at too much, but he has got an 84 block and an 83 steal. And then he's also got some decent playmaking stats with a 91 passing accuracy and 97 court vision. Then you've got yourself a 99 overall Jonathan Kaminga. He is a power small forward. And you can see his stats are looking pretty nice as well. He's got a 99 three-point shot, a 102 mid-range shot, a 101 contested shot, 97 shooting touch, 98 shot off the dribble, 90 dunking, and a 97 layup. This card is looking pretty good, especially considering he is only 99 overall. Then you've got some decent playmaking stats as well. Nothing too special over there. 82 block, a 69 steal, 93 offensive box out, and 91 defensive box out. So he is very good on the offensive side, and he is a decent card, especially considering he is only 99 overall. Then you've got your final master over here, your 97 overall, Joshua Primo. He is a finesse shooting guard over there. He's got a nice three-point shot as well. So the person with the lowest three point shot is going to be that SGA who is the highest overall shooting guard we've got because his three-point shot is all the way at a 91 when even this guy over here the 97 overall master has a 96 three-point shot so a lot better than even that SGA at the end of it I don't understand that particularly well but you've got a 90 mid-range shot a 90 dunking 91 layup 92 shot off the dribble and a 96 shooting touch over there and then on the defensive end you've got a 90 post shot an 81 defensive post strength an 81 block an 80 steal playmaking stats a bit better with an 89 passing accuracy and 95 court vision then these are going to be your events so you've basically you got that event on the left hand side of the game of the night one which is what we've usually got you'll get five of them a day spend through 50 stamina and you will get yourself a player pack and you'll also get one token with that over there so that's going to be helpful not only with this promo but also the main one that's going on at the moment simply because you will get some players you might be able to use in some of those exchange sets which will help you in the long run you can also use them in multi master exchange sets if you're not using them for this event over here you've also got a vip event pass which you can unlock by purchasing it with real money in the store to be able to get yourself an extra five events getting you i think it's an extra two millennial tokens with this event over here they cost 30 stamina an event so a little bit cheaper on the stamina 
the front compared to the main free to play one over there. Then taking a look at the store itself, you can see you get a starter pack giving you some extra tokens, players and NBA cash. You got two store masters over here, which are both one to one masters and they are looking pretty good. And then you've also got some bundles over there. You can see just sneaking in on that right hand side. You've also got some extra stuff. So giving you extra players, some extra tokens and also some tokens for 150 NBA cash and two tokens a day for 25K a piece on those ones over there. So those are going to reset every single day and it is looking like we might get an NBA Summer League promo pretty soon, which is going to be pretty nice to see. It's going to be interesting to see what format that takes, whether it's going to be another Live Today promo, whether it's going to be an achievements and store based one, or whether it's just going to be solely that achievements based promo. Well, I guess we'll find out when that drops. But starting off with the sets over here, we'll start from the bottom to the top and you can see 97 overall, you're going to need 20 tokens, 10, 88 to 92 overall players and 20 83 to 87 overall players but you can use all of these past promo players which makes it pretty easy to do on a player front it's just a case of picking them up on the auction house or if you've got them lying around already it isn't going to be too difficult at all and then you're also going to need those extra tokens 20 of them for the 97 some high overall players to get yourself this 99 coming up but 40 of those tokens again so it's doubled from 20 to 40 for this 99 and then it increases bit by bit as we carry on so 50 millennial tokens plus all of those players to get yourself to 100 overall, 60 tokens plus some more players for that 102 SGA. And then finally at the end, you can see you need 40 millennial tokens plus all of those high overall players, but also you're gonna need four of these Gen Z tokens. Now you will be able to get them by getting the other masters completed. So once you complete the set over here, you'll get that SGA, plus you'll get one of these Gen Z tokens. And it's exactly the same for the other masters. So that 100 overall plus a Gen Z token and also some extra players, you'll get that. Now you will also get some Gen Z tokens from the store from that starter pack. If you do decide to get some of the store masters, you are gonna have to spend a fair amount of money. And it is not no money spent at all to get this 104 DeAndre Ayton. So it's kind of working out how much you have to spend to get this card. And then is it actually worth it in the long run if you are gonna spend that? That much money to get this card kind of think about that if you are spending the money on the game to try and go ahead and get this card but as i said it's a team boost it is plus four to the rebounding stats you've also got an exchange share where you can exchange two of these 86 to 92 year old players to get yourself one millennials token which will help you out and it probably will have a cooldown i'm guessing it will be about a day cooldown i could be wrong about that maybe it's eight hours or something like that we'll find that out when this does drop in the game tomorrow because it is going to be interesting to see but i do kind of wish they would change some of these live today formats up i know that probably won't happen before the end of the season but going into next season i did like what they did with the loyal stars promo on my second account i managed to get lucky enough and pull a 101 john stockton which was kind of the second master. There was no way I could go ahead and get myself that Isaiah Thomas because he's practically impossible to get unless the boosts work on the players. Because if you guys think about it, if the boosts work, you might be able to get that Isaiah Thomas if you got extremely lucky. So I'd like to see some things being changed and altered with that type of promo format. I'm okay with these ones. I don't really play it at all, to be honest, unless I might go for a jersey, depending on what it is. Again, we'll have to wait and see what that jersey is looking like because we usually get a free jersey in the achievement section, giving out a bit of a boost. If it's a nice boost and it's an elite boost, I might actually go ahead and try and get it. But that depends on what it actually looks like when we take a look at this event tomorrow. If you are looking to try and get the main promo masters at the moment and that 104 Jimmy Butler completely free, go check out the video I just made where I explained everything you need to do to get the masters for free and all the calculations to prove that you can get them for free. Go check out that video in the bottom left hand corner and I'll see you guys in that one. Peace.